So I'm going to show you something that is astonishing. Who likes to get a piece of chicken and do flour, egg, flour, breadcrumbs? Simple, right? I'm going to show you the best breadcrumbs in the history, which is bread on its own. OK, so I went fishing today, and I got these sardines here in the river. <laughs> they came all the way from Spain because they knew I was here. So we get the sardine. Are you with me? And we get the slice of bread. Are you with me? And we square it to make sure that more or less it's slightly bigger than the filet. You can use salt, you can use monkfish, but make sure it's not very thick, yes? We put here, you see? And then with a with little bit of a spray, water sprayer, you know, you make sure it's slightly wet. Same technique as the breadcrumbs we did before. Are you with me? Yeah. So we put a little bit of olive oil. And then take a look what happens. This is very unique because this is pure minimalism. Take a look what I do. I put it, you make sure that it's not too hot. Give me one or two more. Yeah. And, she, and you see the bread is protecting from the red heat to the very beautiful, delicate sardine. So take a look what I'm going to do. One, two, three. Already we can see in the edges that the bread is kind of toasted. And careful, because after toasted, it's born. <laughs> yes? So we turn it. But you see, the sardine is slightly translucent right now. What we do now is one, we turn the other, two, the other, three, the other four, one, two, three, four, out. Why? Because the sardines is a blue fish, has a lot of fat content. The fat content heats very quick. It's already cooked. So we get the sardine, we plate it. And here we have breaded sardines. Imagine what we do is something that I think is very unique. We get some raspberries. We put them in a sheaf like this. We smash them. You see, we get all the beautiful puree of the, of, the, of the raspberries. So what we do is we get the spoon and we have this very nice, very unique puree of fresh raspberries that somehow is the same, the same acidity that you find in the vinegar or lemon that we like to pair our anchovies with. Then we put a little bit of olive oil. From where? And because we're celebrating in Spain, and in Spain we have great almonds, especially when you find the Maracona almonds that you find everywhere, what we do is use the almonds this time as a salt. A salt, like something that gives further flavor. We get a microplane, we grate. It's an astonishing texture. And ladies and gentlemen, here we did the sardines breaded with raspberries. Thank you. How much time I have?